Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster and welcome back to Let's Play Breath of Fire 4. Last time we used the log ride to get down the rolling river there and now we're back here in the town of Shide. Or we've made it to the town of Shide. However, uh, before going on, we can actually do a few things on the world. Well, there's one of the, well, yeah, there's one thing I can do on the world map right now. And so let's do that. Now, again, you want to check also to make sure. Okay, it didn't happen there. I would definitely now, at this point, whenever you see a question mark on the world map, start entering it to see uh, if you are able, and actually I need to go this way, to enter a question mark area because you can actually help the fairies. Aha! Okay, so whenever you see this menu here, it says help us. Now, you see there's a lot of there's a lot of monster or a lot of animals in that one place there. So what you can do here is actually we want to change our battle order. And we're going to get Ursula in there. And let's do it like that. Yep. Okay, good. Now, oops. If you talk to this person, if you talk to the fairy, use your sword or a gun to hunt the animals. Try to kill them in one hit. Lowers the quality of the meat. Oops, no. Er. And with Ursula on our team, she can now shoot things down from afar. So now, we're able to do some hunting. Yeah, so as soon as you hit as soon as you hit something though, it starts to run away. There you go. And we shot something. And we get a roast. Yes, let's give that food to the fairies. Yeah, now for, now on all on this map here, there's gonna be um, animals running around, and you can hunt them all down and get some food. Whoops. And while you're hunting, you actually will not run into any random battles. Uh, no, we don't want to leave. I want to shoot some animals now. Okay, get back here. There you go. Start pegging off this deer. Get back here. Get back here, deer. Come on. Thank you. Ooh, a flank. Let's give that to the fairies there. This will definitely be a huge asset to the fairy village. For sure. So I would say start doing this. At this point, oh, now we saw, ooh, we have a big thing there. It looks like a dog there almost. Well, it can't be really be a dog because we don't want to hunt dogs. That's cruel. Yeah, if you're able to get him into a corner, that's the ideal situation. And then start pegging him off. You can also use reuse sword. Now let's give that food to the fairies there. Okay, I'll sh uh, let, me, let me show you here. Oh, well, this one got away. No. But yeah, you, you can use... No! <clears throat> So I'll get these buttons one of these days. Um, but yeah, you can just use Ryu's sword to hit him too. And actually, let me see if I can show that off here. Yeah, you got away. Get back here. Get back here, bird. These things run pretty fast too. Oh, uh. there you go. See, so that's how that's how you can hit one of those things right there. But you got to be kind of tricky because you want to try and trap him in a corner there. Come on, Ryu. Dude, Ryu! God, I'm really bad at this. Okay, screw this. So that's how that works. I'm going to use my gun because I'm much better at, at that. So Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to hunt the rest of these en en enemies down. Oh, nice. There we go. And we get some ribs. Ooh. I like ribs. Okay, so I'm just going to hunt the rest of the enemies down and then be back on the world map once I am done with that. Okay, and actually, once you've completed it, um, the fairy says, thanks so much for helping us. Yeah, I certainly understand that. So, no problem. Happy to help. And now we... Oops. And now we can get out of here. Very good. All right. Now, there's one other thing I want to do before going off to Shide. I want to stop by this house right here. Now, you may recall earlier, we went to this house. This dude said he had married a fairy. Well, after doing some stuff in the fairy village, if you actually go upstairs, yeah, this is this is Nomo. Hey, no problem. Happy to do it. Oh, really? Yeah. Now this is awesome. Great. <laughs> no problem. Yeah. Now we get a new master here. So agility is up by two. AP down by eight. 
So, I think that's going to be better uh, better for us than than um, than Stole right now because it only has an AP up or it only has agility up by one. So let's give that let's do that with Cray there. Um, do I want to study with her slip? Um, Actually, I'm going to wait just a minute before we do uh, any studying with Ursula there. When there are eight fairies in the village, and we'll get and we'll get an actual skill there. So I don't have eight fairies yet. So, but if you've been working on the fairy village, you may have eight fairies by now. And if you do, you'll learn a skill. And as soon as I get that skill, I'll definitely uh, demonstrate that for you guys. So, speaking of the fairy village, let's check in with them and see how they're doing. Also, you can get that vigor seed from there as well uh, from that cabin if you haven't gotten that already. Okay, uh, let's, yeah, let's see how we're doing here. All right, very nice. Let's see what our team says. Shot is where all the merchants go. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we'll go take care of that in just a little bit. Oh, that's right. Yeah, we definitely want to get the sand dragon for sure. Oh, yeah, the Imperial Causeway. I forgot about that. <laughs> Sias like the raft. I like that. Oh, I see. It could be a faded meeting there. Sure. All right. Let's see how things are going here in the fairy village. What do we got here? Hey, all right. And Oban was born. Very nice. And a new job available. Awesome. So yeah, we have four fairies now. Ooh, wow. Hers, her scent, her scent is really high. So that's good. All right. Let's take a look and see how we're doing. I guess you need to have two fairies hunting um, before before um, before you can. Um, Wow, two fairies hunting before you can burn, before some new ones will be born, I guess, is how that works. So, okay. Um, all right. Very nice. So I guess we're going to keep them doing what they're doing. Yeah, so they got some more food there. So that's really good. I like that. And let's see. Actually, I can probably get these. Nope. Oops. <laughs> uh... Let's see, look at jobs and orders. Yeah, because I don't really care about... Yeah, it's under construction right now, so I can't do anything like that. Um, okay, well, there's not really a whole lot I can do here in the fairy village. They're still hunting, so that's good. Um, I guess... I guess you can plow. That's fine. Uh, and you're still running the weapon shop. And Yep, okay. So they'll keep doing their thing, and we'll get some new fairies. Whoops. And now we'll go from there. All right. So now we can head out of here. Actually, I'm going to leave here, rest up, and then we'll head over to Shide. Okay, so let's head over to Shide now. And what I'm going to do is whenever I get to a question mark thing, I'm just going to enter it. And if I get some meat, great. And if I don't, that's okay. All right, let's head over to Shide here. All right, you may remember this place earlier in the game. Uh-huh. Actually, wait. No, I don't think we have been here, have we? Ah, now watch this guy here. Yeah. So you want to catch this guy right from the entrance there, and we get an iron ball. <laughs> nice. Very good. All right, so yeah, we got, there's some sandflyer parts there. So let's go, let's take a look around. There's some merchants here. Actually, let's go talk to these merchants. Yeah, let's take a look and see what we got here. Oh wait, no, this is old stuff here. So never mind. We're uh, n never mind. We don't need to get anything here. Um, you know what I do need to do though is I need to equip the flame sword on Ryu that I got from. Yeah, so it's a little bit less of an attack power than the bastard sword, but it increases my agility and it gives me plus one attack, so I can actually use it twice. So we're definitely going to use that for sure. Okay, this guy, can he sell me anything? 
Oh, well, I see. It's true. Okay, let's see. Can I get anything from this guy? Oh, no, I can't. I guess they, they sell the same thing. Okay. Uh, can I get any panaceas? No. Maybe I can just get... Do they sell the same thing? Yep, I guess they do. Okay. No problem. Okay. So let's, uh, let's head up here. And I want to go this way, actually. Right, let's see what these guys have to say. Yeah, Sinesta. Oh, I see. Chamba. Interesting. All right. I'm going to head up this way. Oh, I see. And go up this way. And we want to go in here. Now let's see what we talk to this guy, see what he says. Sure am. Oh, great. How much do you want? I can give you $12. How do you know if I don't have enough money? Oh. Oh, well, that seems simple enough. Maybe, what, maybe I'll just steal one. All right. Ah, hey, there's one right now. Let's go steal it. Hurry, hurry, hurry up! Okay, and how is Ursula exactly going to do that? Whoa! Nice! A little ninja style, I like that. Ursula the ninja. She's like the female version of Ryuhei Abusa. <laughs> what just happened? Did we just steal a sand flyer? Uh, <gasps> wait a minute! I remember this guy. It's Marlock. Yes. Hey, you started it, punk. You were smoking in the house, and you tried to violate Nina. Dude, don't suck up to him. There's five of us and one of you. Kick your ass. Yes. Uh huh. Yes. Oh. We don't have enough money, remember? We're inside, stupid. <laughs> I like how they shrunk. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Why did they shrink? It's kind of weird. I have heard that money is the root of all evil. This is true. <laughs> Oh, God. Why are they shrinking? Oh, God. Dude, why are you sucking up to them? Saya should just steal one. Why not? <laughs> They're like babies now. <laughs> a Zeef? What is a Zeef? I know it's a thief, but... I guess funny. A Zeef. Oh, cool! Wow, they, wow, they grew back really quickly. They must have ate the Mario Power Mushroom. Uh, sure. And we get Bond. Marlock Bond. Maybe? I don't know. Well, great! Alright! What kind of Bond did he give us? Why? Is this like New Horizons where you are going to get tenfold in return? Oh, well, that's nice. <laughs> Whoa! Did you see that? That's the same shiny thing that Fulu had. Uh huh. Yeah! Yeah, but come on, Cray. You need you should always know that there's no such thing as a free lunch. Alright, cool. Uh before going on, we wanna go uh let's see. Yeah, we wanna go up here first. Talk to this guy. 
I'm doing good, how are you? I think so. Oh, cool. Okay, now notice you've got the star by shift there. So let's talk to him. What? Hey, that's great! Oh, wow! That's cool! Wow! That's awesome! That's fantastic. I love it. Very nice. Alright. Sounds good. And now we have basically like the return spell, so we can go to anywhere previously. That's going to save us a lot of time. Okay. So now that we've got that all taken care of, let's head in here. Talk to this guy one more time, now that we have the bond. I do want to buy a sand flyer. Here you go. I'll just pay for it in cash. No big deal. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, I'm just paying in cash. No big deal. I run a, an illegal dragon trading business. All, all right, now we have our very own sand flyer. Uh huh. No, I don't want to. I don't need to do that. I'm just gonna drive recklessly. This is an RPG. That's what happens. Okay, use the right and left buttons. Wait a minute. This almost looks like a little mini game. Uh huh. Okay, so circle excels, X button breaks. Okay. Woo! Nope, I'll be fine. You'll get the hang of it soon, but once we try. Yep! Alright, sounds good. Hey, Dad. Will do. Hey, Dad. Can I take the sand flyer out for a trip? Right. And now we have access to our very own sand flyer. That's awesome. Uh, no. Where is the sand dragon? Oh. Okay. Sounds good. Why don't you just tell me now? Okay. And now we want to go to the coin area. Okay. And now we have another little mini game. So if you push this... So basically what we need to do... We need to navigate our way through this course and get to the very end there. And so those little, those little uh, brown things—that's that's a hill. However, if you hit a dune, woo, yeah. But if you hit a dune incorrectly, it causes you to to um, exit the course there. So you just need to be very careful about how you control yourself through this thing. And basically, just make your way to the other end of the uh, of the course there. Once you do that, yeah. So that dune's not going to be very helpful for us. Basically, just make your way through. And once you've done that, that's it. And so you can play this little mini game if you want. I don't care about my replay. This is not like Mario Kart. Now we've made it here to coin. All right, so let's go use that gateway. And we should be okay. Hey, what do you mean the gateway stopped working? What are you talking about? Oh, no. No one can get home. What if we go up here? Why not? Why can't I use the causeway? I used it just fine earlier. Oh. Well, I have absolutely no idea who would do that. No. I have no clue at all. None. No idea. Hmm. There used to be a man in that house. I wonder where he went. No, I have no idea. None. Ursula? What? No! Uh, no? Hey, you guys started it. It's all your fault. It's the, Imperial, it's the Imperial Army's fault, or the Empire's fault. What the? Who's there? Hey, it's this dude. Uh, no? <laughs> no, okay. Yes, this is our sand flyer. Yep. You need to get to Schick. 
Why do you need to get the shik? What's there? Oh, I see. I hear there's a big lake or something near Shik. Uh-huh. Oh, I see. Ah, uh, sure. Why not? All right. Now let's do this. Okay, sounds good. Well, let's do this one more time. Let's go to the Shik region. So we have one more little mini game to do. And I'm just getting this all out of the way today. Uh, so that we can do what we want to do next episode and spend the whole next episode doing that. All right. Okay, well, that was a kind of a disaster. Okay. Whee! Yeah. That's how you can ride the sand dunes and just have a little fun doing that. Occasionally, if you're lucky, you can hit it pretty hard and jump over. Uh... Woo! You can jump over the, uh, like a little part of the course there. Yeah, so do a little loop-de-loop -loop there. All right, now we want to go this way. Yeah, so this isn't the most fun in the world, but it's all right. Definitely not something I'll be... Oh, damn it. Yeah, so that's how you can sometimes, if you hit a dune, you can jump over... And just uh, take little shortcuts there. But there you are. Got it. <laughs> they can see us bouncing around having some fun. But oh well. Yep. No problem. Happy to do it. Oh, fantastic. Yes. Where's my payment? Oh, sure, no problem. And we get a silver top, which is, I believe, a fishing item. But Stoll? He's one of our masters! Wait a minute. I know that guy. To Levant. What's in Levant? Who, and Ursula's ready to kick some ass. A ship? And now we need to somehow get a ship. Or we could go do a bunch of side quests. What option will I pick? You'll have to wait till next time to find out. So then, this is BCS Buster signing off. Don't forget to like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter, BCS Buster LP. Check out my blog. Check out my donations page. And as always, take care, y'all.